How to use the white gap and separator elements in Vantage Advanced Designer. I'll start by creating a skill in Vantage Advanced Designer. And I'll upload a document. Once uploaded, I can view the document. For demonstration purposes, I won't define any fields for now, but rather jump right into Activities, select the Extraction Rules activity, and click on Activity Editor. I want to find the white gap under the word Catalog, so I'll start by creating a static text element called Keyword Catalog. My search text will be Catalog. I'll click Match and confirm that I have found the word Catalog. Next, I'll create an element of the white gap type. I'll specify a search area relative to the position of the word catalog. I'll create a left boundary and make an adjustment as needed. Then I will create a right boundary and make a similar adjustment. I also want to look below the word catalog. I will use the measure tool to calculate how big the white gap I'm looking for should be. With a measured height of 69 dots, I'll enter 60 as my minimum height. Before I click match, a best practice is to also specify that I'm looking for the white gap nearest to the word catalog. I'll make that selection now, then click match. I can see that the white gap was located correctly. Now I wish to locate the horizontal line above the white gap and nearest to the white gap. I'll create a separator element. I'll keep the horizontal orientation setting and specify a minimum length of 300 dots. Next, I'll specify the search area. I want to look above and nearest to the white gap. I'll make one quick adjustment. I'll rename this element separator above and I'll create another element of the separator type called separator below. Again, I'll keep the horizontal orientation setting and specify a minimum length of 300 dots. I'll specify the search area, this time looking below the white gap and nearest to the white gap. One more quick adjustment is needed. Clicking match allows me to check my results in the hypothesis tree. Here's my white gap. Here's my separator line above the white gap, and here's my separator line below the white gap.